After a night of looting a few weeks ago, a local speedway on Lake Avenue in Rochester decided to close up shop for good. Now we hear they may reopen. Eric had a cost headed out to that gas station to find out what's happening. As you can see behind me, this station is boarded up and looks abandoned after corporate owners decided they wanted out of their lease after a night of looting a few weeks ago. Now we're hearing from the landlord they've changed their minds. David Pelusio is the owner for this Speedway property. He says the station has been here since the 60s and is the only station for miles. I think it's a, it's a key location for the, for the neighborhood in order for them to get gas. Owners say they wanted out of their lease after the violence. Pelusio says he did everything he could to convince them to stay. He wasn't worried about the money. He just didn't want the station gone. I, my concern was to get it open for the neighborhood. He asked the Rochester mayor and several city leaders for help, and they got involved. His concern and, and our concern is we wouldn't like a vacant, boarded-up business on one of our major commercial corridors. Miller says he presented corporate owners with information and resources to help them. He said he explained to them the Business Emergency Retention Grant Program, which is two to three thousand dollars for businesses to pay rent and any other capital needs. I explained to her that we did have some funding available for businesses if they were damaged and uh, she did ask for an application which I provided to her. News 8 also reached out to the corporate owners of Speedway last night and we are currently waiting a response. This gas station is not the only business that's been offered help recently by the city of Rochester. The city says they reached out to about 87 other people as well. For now, reporting in downtown Rochester, I'm Erica Cost, News 8. All right, Erica, thank you.